Hello and welcome to Two Minutes of Anatomy. I am Dr. Donald Lozello of Championship Chiropractic in Las Vegas, Nevada. The scapulothoracic joint is a joint that is the articulation between the posterior ribcage and the anterior scapula. This joint is one of the most versatile and mobile joints in the body. I'm going to be discussing the motions of the scapular thoracic joint and the muscles that when contracted concentrically cause those motions. Protraction is when the scapula moves away from the spine. Concentric actions of the serratus anterior, the pectoralis major, and the pectoralis minor are the source of scapular protraction. Scapular retraction is when the scapula is moved closer to the spine. Concentric actions of the middle trapezius, the lower trapezius, the rhomboid major, and the rhomboid minor are the source of scapular retraction. Elevation of the scapula is caused by a concentric action of the upper trapezius, the levator scapula, and the rhomboid major and rhomboid minor. Depression of the scapula is caused by a concentric contraction of the latissimus dorsi, the serratus anterior, the pectoralis major, the pectoralis minor, and the lower trapezius muscles. Upward rotation of the scapula is caused by a concentric action of the upper trapezius and the serratus anterior muscles. Downward rotation of the scapula is caused by a concentric contraction of the latissimus dorsi muscle, the levator scapula, the rhomboid major and the rhomboid minor, the pectoralis major and the pectoralis minor muscles.